Hello, we're at the PCB uh, Expo. This is uh, one of the last ex electronics expos for 2011. We've just finished uh, 660 uh, interviews, si no, over 600 interviews. And right now, I just want to show you the steps we take in managing the interview process and also prospecting when we come to the expo. First of all, when we come to the expo, we will go to every counter. And every counter, we, we come with me and I'll just show you. Every counter here, we'll go to a counter like this and we would actually introduce ourselves to the vendor. And so we'll take their card. Ni hao. Ah, we'll hang gas in Jandan here. Ah, what are Tong say? Shang Gani to Iga Fong Wan. And so we would actually uh, show them this brochure and explain to them what we're doing and the value of the project to the vendor or the interviewee. And in the process, we're asking them to help us do the interview. Um, if that doesn't work, we will actually show them a longer report which we'll give it to them after we analyse the data and this is based on 200 interviews done already but that's a longer report that we need but in the process we in either case we will actually take their card and staple it onto the book like this and note the location the location and then make a note whether we come back in the afternoon or we do the interview right now. And in this case, the vendor is so nice that we are actually in the process of doing an interview. And that interview requires uh, the following, that is a nine page instrument of over 100 questions. And the interview takes 35 minutes or up to one hour in some cases, depending on how much time the uh, vendor has, the interviewee, the supplier and we'll slowly go through this. It's very, very important that when we're doing the interview, and we've, we come around, follow me around here, because we're actually doing interview right now. Um, so we're doing an interview right now, and you can see that we have the questionnaire that we're going through, and you can see that there's a lot of discussion that goes on when we're doing the interview. So we ask the questions, but what, what is very important in the interview process is that the interviewer is actually asking the questions that is written down on the questionnaire and the because we want to know the answer from the interviewee rather than the interviewee fill out the questionnaire and give it back to us later because we want to understand why they answered the way they did. There are about 10 open-ended questions that we ask throughout the interview um, which are the hows and whys they respond to different questions so we can get much more in-depth understanding about the hows and whys of the responses through the interview. What's very important for the interview also right at the start as I said is actually me meeting the supplier, getting their permission, explain to them the value of participating in this project, not just the academic value to me but the value to them in giving them a report and so we get them on board and then they can work with us and actually provide us with un provide us with uh, uninterrupted uh, interview time. Of course, when customers come along, it's, they can get up and actually serve the customers. Uh, the most important thing and the reason why these suppliers are here is not to interview with us, but actually to serve their customers. There are two types of customers. There are their current customers that will come and sit down and just chat or talk about uh, various uh, transactions they're doing or there are prospective customers that they are trying to sell or develop their relationship with in the hope of becoming an approved supplier or having future transactions with that customer. So there you have it, there's the China Supplier 1000. We're really grateful for having Cooper, he's our interviewer today in this video and he's going through this interview now, uh, step by step, page by page and filling out the interview. Very methodical, as I said, uh, we're up to 600 interviews now, we've taken it step by step, it's taken 12 months to get over 600 and uh, nothing good is done in a very short time, uh, no good data collection is done in a short time, there is no shortcuts when it comes to research and this is and will be the largest ever 
face-to-face -face interview study of Chinese manufacturers in the world in history. Thank you.